Everybody. Sturdy Deborah Harry here at the Fountain Valley Skating Center. Another late night video for you. I'm with the Dirty School of Skate and Sugar Roller Skates. And tonight we're going to do things just a little bit differently. Tonight I'm going to actually show you what we're going to learn first and then we'll go through instruction, okay? So hopefully Xavier, who's filming, can keep up with me and we can get this thing rolling. Now, this, what I'm going to show you tonight, is one of the most commonly requested items. And I get it like this. Hey, can you show me how to do that thing, you know, where you go like that with your feet? Okay. What I think most people are asking for, they say that thing where, you know, you're skating, you put one foot in front of the other. other all right actually what i think they're talking about is this as we cruise around the skating floor at the roller rink you can just be moving to the beat of the music you don't have to push backward you're just pushing out and bringing your foot forward so we push out bring it forward out bring it forward you can move along pretty effortlessly like this and you can go really fast without All right, you gotta know how to do scissors. Scissors, probably one of the very first things you ever learned if you ever took a skating class ever. One of the first things you learn is scissors and it looks like this. You start with your feet out, arms out. You push out, bring it in, push it out, bring it in. Looks simple, looks easy, but there's a lot of stuff going on here. Number one, body weight. We drop our body weight down, bend our knees, pick up our body weight, get your knees back together. Down, 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 up, 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 up. You see me do this before in other videos, and I say, down with the butt, up with the gut, down with the butt, up with the gut, down, 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 up, up, up. When I say up, 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 I literally can feel me pressing my gut against my spine and sucking it all up. That's what's bringing my feet together. I steer my feet together a bit with my knees. So when I say down, up, 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 I push my knees right back together to bring it in. All right? So those are scissors. You're going to have to do a ton of scissors. And I tell you this, the benefit of scissors is strengthens your edges, strengthens your legs, and gives you a better butt. No one's going to complain about that, am I right? Okay. Now, when we're thinking of skating around the floor, how can we do scissors? It just might look silly if we're just going down with the butt, up with the gut, down with the butt, up with the gut, all the way around. No one wants to do that. To make it look good and to be moving nice and easy, you need to go down, push out, bring one foot forward, down, push out, bring one foot forward. Let me show you again. Down with the butt, we're up with the gut, we're bringing the feet together, and as we bring it together, you're gonna to be riding on your heel. That means the vast majority of your body weight is going to be put on your skating leg. When I say skating leg, I mean the leg attached to the ground. Your free leg or the leg that comes up off the ground is gonna be riding on its heel as it comes forward. Then you bring it back, you go down, out, up, and forward up on your heel so to get comfy with this you might want to just skate forward and pop one heel like that or pop your toe up like that all right just go down and up down up down up down up all right so we can go down out and up down out and up down out and up a lot of people worry about this when they bring their feet close together because they think that they're going to hit. You're going to hit. More often than not, this will not happen, but it's definitely going to happen if you look at your feet. 
If you stare at your feet, you're practically willing your skates to come together and hit them, okay? You need to look ahead. The other thing is, I gotta say this, skating is a social sport. You may be here by yourself at the rink, meaning you came by yourself, you didn't come with a bunch of people and you're out there skating around, but skating inherently is a social sport. So in order for you to do it and look good doing it as you're skating along, you need to be looking around, talking to people, at least making eye contact and smiling. Okay, this kind of attitude facilitates this kind of skating where you're just cruising along, having a good time, okay? So I'm go down, out, up, down, out, up, down, out, up, down and out, bring it in and up, down and out, bring it in and up. Now we're just cruising. So there's lots of variations on this later on where you can put your own style and your moves into it. But for now, I just need you to get this basic maneuver down. So scissors first. Do tons and tons and tons of scissors and then start bringing it forward and up, forward and up. All right, you guys? So I hope you learned something in this video. Maybe something that uh, you can share with others. I get a lot of feedback on, I watched your video, I learned how to do it, and then I taught someone else. And I cannot even express how exciting it is for me that if I teach you something, you teach someone else something, and now we all know how to skate. So please feel free to take these words, my crazy little ways of expressing things, and go ahead and teach it to other people, okay? I would love to spread the good word, right? Skating, it's like a religion, all right? All right, you guys, we gotta go. Xavier's got to go like skiing tomorrow or something. Apparently we have to go home. <sighs> Otherwise we would just stay here all night. All right, skaters, thank you so much for watching this video. Now, as always, go practice.